Well, I said I'd show you a picture of the house, so you can you can see a lot of it from this angle, but it's huge. It's rather big. Let me go down this way just a little bit. Show you something. Look at that big old barn. Now you can see the front of the house. That sucker is huge. See it? Whoa! He's coming at me. Yeah, you can see last night it was up above this road and it washed all that down. That had been standing up for a while. But I tell you something, this is not nothing compared to the rain we had the last time. It rained like three days in a row with Tropical Storm Bill. But this was just a light rain. Oh, here he comes. Oh man, he is getting it. Look at that. Look at the water. Boy, that's a lot of water. Look, it washed up against that fence. Yeah, I'd say that's impassable right there, people. See this gravel road right there? That's called Popcorn Something Road. This is Cottonwood going this way. And that's the creek going that way. Well, the road is impassable. This is 186. Right up that road is Rogersville. But right here is a low spot in the road that makes it impassable during a high rain event. So I've got to turn around. I'm not going to be able to go there. That's 15 miles to that Hardy's restaurant. But right now I'm at 13.47 and I'm turning around. I don't normally ride in weather like this. <laughs> As a matter of fact, very seldom do I ride in weather like this. All right. All right, people, I'm at 186. 125 is right behind me. And that water looks too deep to ride through. So now I got to go down 186 to get to County Line Road. Boy, this has been a wet, long ride, but it's fun. <laughs> oh, look at that whirlpool. Man, you wouldn't want to get stuck in that. Boy, that's some rough water right there. Hey everybody, look, this is Buddy. That's the walking track right there, and it's underwater. Look at the current. As you can see, it's two o'clock and the water is still up and it's still running. So, I'm at the old sea now, and uh, I'm gonna go swimming here in just a little bit, swim some laps. But I tell you, that is a lot of water. 
but it's good it's a good thing it'll actually clean out i noticed there was a lot of debris from the last time it flooded now hopefully this will kind of help move it on out all right hey everybody this is buddy well i was standing just right over there where that fence is you can see the debris on the fence yesterday uh, this is how high the water is now now ain't that something look back over here look at that now they call this flash flash flooding in ozark missouri but I tell you what, yeah, I could take them to Mississippi. I could show them some flash floods. Because <laughs> um, when the water floods in Mississippi, the, the Mississippi River backs up, and then all them basins, you know, them creeks and things, and you know, when they flood, they flood for real. It ain't no plan. But uh, here, uh, it just seems like it runs off pretty quick. Hopefully, that's what's going to happen. 